Here's how to set up and use Apple Pay on your Mac. Now, if you're on your Mac and you want to be able to pay for things directly on your Mac without entering in the card details, I'll show you how to do it. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, let's get into your settings here. So let's go to the top left and tap on the Apple icon. And then we'll go down and let's choose system settings from here. Once you're into the system settings, all you need to do is scroll down on the left hand side until you get to wallet and Apple Pay. Just tap on that. You can see I already have two cards added on here. If you didn't already have a card in there, just hit the add card button. This will allow you to either enter in the details manually or it'll just take a photo of that specific card. It takes a few seconds to pop up and when it does, you'll be able to continue hitting add card here. And then again, you can either position the card in the frame or enter card details manually and then you will have added that. Now let's go back out of here. After you've done that, you can see under payment details is the default card that they will use, the shipping address, email, phone number, etc. Now, after we've done all that and set everything up, you can go into a web browser like Safari. And you can see here, I'm just on apple.com and I have a 14 inch MacBook Pro in my cart. Now, if you wanted to basically pay for this using Apple Pay, what you're going to look for is the little Apple Pay icon when you go to check out. Some will have it, some won't. But if they do have it, all you need to do is click on it and it'll pop up with a little screen. It'll say, what are you using? Which card? What the contact information, the shipping and the basically shipping here, whether it's free or two day, you can sometimes change the shipping option here. Now, all you have to do at the very bottom is says pay with touch ID. So you can just use that touch ID and it will automatically make that purchase using your Apple wallet and the cards on file. Hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you have any questions. Thanks, guys.